what's up guys welcome to pro realities tv home of the freshest entertainment news and entertaining video kindly hit the subscribe button if you've not subscribed and if you've already subscribed i appreciate it peace what's up guys welcome back to pro realities tv home of the freshest entertainment news and filler and as you always know i bring you nothing but the hottest filler and the current filler going around has to do with john demello and my yes yes john demello we all know john demello was is one of Ghanaian's favorite veteran actor you know he's part of the actors who's brought us amazing movies doing all these years and recently he decided to you know join politics to be able you know to help his community which is the ayahuas west wagon as he basically said he came into politics because he realized that there were a lot of stuff that it's not being done for his for the youth and his community and he feels like he's been already doing the little what that he can do but if given the power he can do more so he decided to join politics and currently he's standing for his community which is the uh, Iowa West Wagon he's trying to stand for an MP and he's going against uh, a lady Madam Lydia as we all know she's the current MP for the uh, consistency and now she's going against John Dumelo. so we all know they've been going back and forth and trying to you know who should win the seat and we've been going back and forth even though recently this past few uh, months and weeks you know it's been becoming something that like we don't expect from like leaders or people in power anyway we all know recently they had a debate because it's close to election so uh Dumelo came and was you know waiting for this lady madam Lydia, who she came late and after the late doing a discussion john Dumelo was saying that well it, there was a gutter choke in the concert in their community so he decided to get a tractor to get it clean but madame Lydia stopped him from doing that and when she was asked during the debate she said well and uh, said so john de he would think before like him trying to do that and people didn't like that because if there's a problem in your community and he's trying to fix it for the betterment for the people of the community and you stop it because of your own agenda that's very bad and aside that insulting him too so john Mello, when she said that he tried to get mad but he, he calmed down and you know they continue the debate well we all want the best for the community and ghana at large but we don't want this kind of politics and so then you know but that's not the only case so after that going on well it's few days to the election and my lady has done it again she went to uh she went to get some of john Melo's colleagues you know to come and campaign against him i'm talking about actors who john demello have worked with and you know actresses and comedians and all that now they've come boldly to support my lydia against john demello you know trying to act you know i'm not trying to take sides here but i feel like she's overdoing it you understand yeah it's politics you guys do whatever but at least as a leader of a, like a community you have to add some dignity to what they're doing that's why basically i don't even like african politics not talk of Ghana. it's just full of insult and ungodliness you understand so far john Melo has just been doing it the right way the way the politicians are supposed to go about it I, i've not seen him insulting a lady or anything or trying to do some extra stuff he's just campaigning and he has the right to uh, my leader also has the right to campaign but i feel like she's overdoing it she's doing some personal stuff that you know it's not nice of a, a leader or a leader of a community and all that well also recently they also decided to uh, join her some of uh, john mello's colleagues to campaign against him and which i feel like it's it blew the belt but hey to each to his own especially after recently uh, one of the ministers made a statement that parliament is not a place for actors it's for serious people so if 
one of the ministers could open her mouth and say something like that just recently and an actor trying to branch into that part of a platform in order to put some dignity on the the craftsmanship and all that and his own colleague actors are campaigning against him i feel like it's some type of way although they have their right but i feel like you know she knows what she's doing and anyway but that's what's currently going on in regards to like uh john Dumelo and mali they fighting for the west wagon election so we just hope for the best may the best man win but i just hope that all these extra things will be you know taken out of the whole stuff so currently that's what Malidia has done she decided to get john melo's colleagues to campaign against him which i know is a shade and all that so that's the current filler going around uh as you always know hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed and if you're already subscribed i appreciate it I'll be back with the next filler. Peace.